Greetings, salutations, guys. Hayden here. Welcome to our live sale. I'm sorry I'm so late, um, but <laughs> I was trying to get out of everything out here. I was going to go outside and do the live over there, but then I was like, wait a minute. The boys are going to come home from school early today, and it's going to be chaotic and crazy over there. So I am over here instead. Did I start the right live? Hold on. Did I click on the wrong one? No, I think I'm on the right one. But happy, uh, what day is it today? Thursday, everyone. Uh, it is March 23rd, 2023. And if you're watching this video after the live is already over, check down below in the description box. Items availability and their pricing will be down there. And you can send me an email if you have any questions or would like to purchase anything. And you can do that with any of the old videos as well. Um, but yeah, I hope you you guys are all having a great day. The sun has kind of come out here where I am. It's supposed to still be raining today, so I have no clue what's actually happening with the weather. <laughs> it's been nuts recently. But hi, Liz. Hi, Tara. Hi, ladies. How are we doing today? Hope you guys are having a great day so far. Oh, something just flew into my eyeball. My allergies have also been going crazy this morning, so I apologize if I sound crazy, but... Allergies are nuts. Oh, I just like scratched my eyes and now my eyeballs are like so red. Hi, Hannah. <laughs> oh, now I look crazy. But yeah, geez, did everyone have a good week so far? Is everyone excited for the weekend? Hi, Purple Rain. How are you? Okay. I wanted to get some sunglasses. Is ready. I have these. Also, today's giveaway. I have one more last Twilly for a giveaway, and this is in a navy. And then it has like these really pretty, like purple, pink accents and gold accents to it. So it's really, really fun. That is today's giveaway. Hi, Tofu. Hi, Pollyanna. Oh my gosh, it's hailing over there, Tara. Goodness, it was raining here so intensely last night. There actually might have been hail. I didn't go look anymore, but the rain was so loud. It sounded like someone was playing drums outside. Like, it was, it was crazy. That's not what I was looking for. Is it this one? Okay, here we are. I think I hear the boys coming, or maybe not. I feel like I can hear them. They're like a stampede outside when they're coming home. And they're like still in the driveway and I can hear them like coming in. Oh yeah, I can hear Eliza. And my sister. I don't know who is louder, honestly. My sister or Eliza. Okay. Sorry, I'm trying to get my little notes set up. Today is the 23rd. Isn't that so crazy? It's literally already at the end of the month. And my birthday month is going to be over. Is anyone's birthday in April coming up? I'm getting the link for the giveaway. Ew, I never changed my photo for this. I hate when I accidentally forget to change like my thumbnail photo for my YouTube videos. And then they always pick the worst still from the video and they just put it up. I'm usually like going like that or something. And it's just like, what is even happening? Okay, there we go. That took forever. Hi, Dorothy. 
I like. The, I love them too, Hana. I'm sorry, I don't have any more though. This is like literally my last. Like, this is my last one. I need to get some more. I like doing them as giveaways. I think they're really fun. Oh, you're walking the dogs, Pollyanna. Have fun. I'm like. Wait a minute. Did I? Let me actually try to switch it right now. Uh, oh, help me think of a giveaway question too, for today. So. I can pop that up. Has anyone gotten any good thrift finds recently? Anything good? Oh, I hate that the photos aren't showing up here. I'm probably just gonna have to look at it on my phone. Do I even have a photo for this one? I don't even know. It was from the, uh, the other day. It was like from the other day's video, so I feel like it doesn't really matter. But I look like a crazy person in that video. Oh, there it is. I think I just like passed out before I can post that, like change the photo or something when I was um, making the video. Okay. Where is it? There we go. That's the photo it should have been, but... My dog just ate street... <laughs> what? What street food? <gasps> Polly Anna, that sounds beautiful. Hi, Anne. Hi, Deborah. Okay. All right. So, what was I trying to do? Um, so that was our giveaway. Here's the link. Also, and let me think of a question. I feel like the lag is so bad between the... Okay, what should a question be? <laughs> what is your favorite street food? Hi, Apatia. Hi, Jay Sweet. Hello. Ooh, that's a good one, Purse Curator. I like that. Thank you for that question. Let's do that. What is your favorite summer handbag style? Leave your answer in the comments of this video. And you could win this really pretty navy blue twilly today. Yay! Oh my gosh, a strawberry cheesecake and pineapple upside down cake. Is that you, Eliza? <gasps> Hello, my little angel. Woo! Say hi. Hi. How was school? Good. Where's Thackeray Binks? He's in there. Are you busy today at 3? Kate already asked me if I can pick him up from school, if that's what you're going to ask me. Oh. He asked me this morning. I, I asked you through a message and you didn't message me back. Oh, I didn't see. 
Okay. Right, Eliza? Are you going to come with me, Eliza? He can't yet. That's why I, I, that's why he has to get picked up. Because I have to go to gymnastics. Oh, that's right. Oh, and sorry, Eliza. And I actually Eliza. need to go gymnastics oh, every day. Every gymnastics. Day. Uh, Hi, everybody. Eliza's training for the, the for the BB Olympics. <laughs> for the Little Where's Angel the Olympics. No, I'm training to become an astronaut. Oh, an astronaut. He says that gymnastics and is training to become an Are you an training astronaut. for the Junior Olympics, too? Because... I could go upside down in space. Oh. That's the point. Oh. Wow, that was so fast. Okay. Say hi to everyone, Eliza. You didn't hi. even say hello. So you want to say hi to everybody? Where's the hammer? The hammer. Yeah. So is this where you bang the hammer? Yeah. Yeah, that's my thing. Wait, hold on. I love you. Are you guys gaveling? No, I'm, I'm gonna, um... Yeah, I'm, I'm a computer expert. You press this one. Press this one. This one. Ooh. I'm out. What triangle? Got it? Oh, are you gonna do your homework now? You. If you finish your homework, I'll let you play with this cute little glutatama. I already finished. I already finished. What does it do? Um, he, he has something special that goes with it, but I'll yeah. give it to you yeah, if you finish your homework already. Okay. Okay, go finish your homework. Carrot snack. So that way you can train for the Olympics later. <laughs> oh, you're astronaut training. That's right. <laughs> All right. <laughs> there isn't Zach and Kate. Uh, Zach and Eliza's hair is like literally the best. Okay, sorry for that. But here is the giveaway again for you guys who haven't had a chance to enter yet. There's the giveaway link, and then leave your answer to today's question. What is your favorite summer style of handbag? I I feel like I always just like a crossbody. Like that's the best. But. Five percent? That's like literally nothing, Hipatia. That's crazy. Is it like, are they just, are they going to keep increasing the discount maybe? Like maybe like for right now it's like five percent and then like in a week or two they'll increase it. I think that's what they do with other sales that they have over there. Uh, Ellen. Actually, curly hair does run in the family on both sides. Um, I actually kind of have curly hair, but I always blow dry it. And when it's short, like it doesn't really show, but I always still blow dry it anyway, because my hair just goes in every direction unless I blow dry it. And um, my mom actually has pretty wavy hair as well, but she always blow dries her hair also. And then my mom's mom, my grandma, she had actually really curly hair that looks like, um, it was, it's actually like in between Zach and Eliza's hair, the two boys that you just saw. Her hair was in between that. And then on their dad's side, they have really curly hair. <gasps> Hepatia, I'm not. I'm sorry. I'm actually currently using the Dio right now. It is such a good bag. I love it. At least for right now, I'm keeping it along with the sunglasses. She says she hasn't heard of it going to increase. Oh, really, Tara? That's cool. She works at Nordstrom Rack. Yeah, I feel like they might just ship over, like, the rest of the stuff or something. My Nordstrom Rack needs it. I feel like my Nordstrom Rack is literally always empty. Every time I go there, I feel like there's really nothing in there ever. It's so crazy. Hi, Kirsten. Oh, they're not going to ship over because of the duties? Really? Even if it's their own items? No way. Vadrian said that they heard that they're not sending over the stuff from Canada to the U.S. because of duties. So, like, of fees and stuff. So maybe um, they'll just start increasing this, this, like, the discount over time. 
maybe. <gasps> That's so long. Does your does your daughter live in Canada, Tara? That is such a long shift, though. She must have gotten like overtime for sure. Um, okay, let's get started. Oh, wait, hold on. I think I had some other stuff I wanted to grab. Does anyone have anything specific they want me to show? Hi, Carmen. How are you? I'll wait until they get desperate. Yeah, I feel like they're just, like, holding on. Um, they're going to try to, like, drag it out, I feel like. I do have some sunglasses. I'm actually going to pull some more, I think, from my collection. I have so many. Gator needs to downsize a little bit. So I think I might do a couple. So let me actually go through these really quickly. Because I think I want to do a couple of these for sure. I just have to leave by 3.15 because I have to pick up Cade from school. <laughs> because John's not going to be here to do a pickup for us because he's going out with our cousins. And Vijay's like, ugh, that is so rude. I know. So rude. Are these my... Okay. Sorry guys, I'm like looking through my sunglasses here. But... I am going to do some of these that I have here. So I can downsize some of these because I have so many. So, okay, let's actually start off with this right here. It'll be our first item. Oh, surprises those you can use. Wow, that's awesome, Tara. Oh, Carmen, okay. Have a good day at work. Oh, Maryland. Okay. Um, oh, do I have any key charms, keychains? Hi, Marion. How are you? Should I let go of some of my key charms? I don't know. Here's our first item, though. These are extra large aviators. Um, these are the Givenchy ones. I think I'm just going to let these go. I literally have so many sunglasses that... Uh, but these are so cute. Okay. These are Givenchy aviators. They are in gold. And then they kind of have like an ombre gray lens. Ish. Actually, no. They're just like... Why do they look kind of ombre-ish? Yeah, they're like a slight ombre. It's like a little bit lighter at the bottom. Um, ombre gray lens. They are gold frames. And then they have these crystals on the side. They're embedded in the metal. Tosh, no, I'm sorry. Those sold during the last live. Like right after the live ended. 
someone messaged me asking for them. Hi, Angelie. It's okay, Angelie. I'm late, too. So, these are literally the first item for the sale. And these are in like new condition. These are, number one, our Givenchy gold frame aviators with crystals. And these are going to be how much are you doing for these? Okay, these are going to be $130. And that's going to be item number one. Alright. Up next, item number two. These are so good, though. I love these glasses. Now that I'm looking at myself wearing them, I'm like, maybe I should keep these. I definitely have a problem. <laughs> Okay, our next item, let's do a bag. And Kirsten, I'm going to I'm gonna go through my charms, my bag charms and stuff and see if I can Oh Purple Rain! Okay, Purple Rain's taking them off of my hands. Congratulations, Purple Rain. These are yours. You're gonna love these. They're so pretty. Look at the the sides are so good. So so good. Okay, congratulations. You're going to be so stylish this summer. Okay. Aviators. So good. These are beautiful. I have more sunglasses, so don't worry. Uh, next up, I have... Oh, I have this um, black Safiano Kate Spade satchel. It's in a black Safiano leather. It has light gold hardware. There's a little... Um, luggage bag charm thing right there there also are little feetsies on the bottom there's a nice big front pocket right here and this does also have the cross body strap which is removable if you wanted to take that off and the inside is in pretty good shape there's a few like small pen marks at the bottom they're kind of hard to see because they're like because just because of the print inside um, and there is some slight discoloration around the interior zipper pocket, but otherwise the bag is in really great shape. The exterior is in good, sh uh, in good shape. There's two pockets inside, open pockets. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. Oh my gosh. I told you guys my allergies are so crazy today, so I apologize if I am sneezing throughout the day. Um, but yeah, black Safiano Kate Spade satchel. Black pebbled or black Safiano leather, gold hardware. And this is item number two. Let me set those over there. Um, yeah, I can do the sunglasses first, actually. If you guys don't mind, you guys mind if I do all the sunglasses first? So black Safiano um, Kate Spade satchel with gold hardware. And this is. Okay, this is going to be $60. That's going to be item number two. This bag's in great shape. Just a few small, like, pen marks on the inside. But again, you can't really see it because of that lining. Okay, so that's number two. Then let me go through some glasses. Okay. Our first, our second pair of glasses is going to be... Okay, this is very similar to the other pair of sunglasses, but these are in gray and they don't have any crystals. But this is in a gunmetal colored hardware, like the metal, and it has the G, like the little Givenchy logos on the sides right here. But they are uh, metal gray, aviator, oversized frames. It's okay, Pollyanna. Okay, so this is number three. This is our gunmetal Givenchy Aviators. And these are also in like new condition. And these have gray lenses and these are $115. Those are going to be item number three. And then our next pair of sunglasses are gonna be um these are prada sunglasses 
These are also in like new condition. They still have the little Nordstrom tag. The retail for these were $352. And these have a tortoise shell, um, tortoise shell, like a little arms, like the, the frame, arms. And they have a mirrored lens. And this is how they look on. You just put that like there. So he's so distracting. This is how these look. And these are Prada. They just have a little, um, it says Prada on the sides in silver. That's on both sides. And this is item number four. Prada Tor Brown Tors. Sunglasses with mirrored lenses. And these are also 115. It's item number four. And then I'm just gonna try to go through these really quickly because for the sunglasses. Uh, which one of these am I gonna do? Not me just going through all these really quickly right here. No. No. You have a video? <clears throat> oh, I have these. Um, these are Rag and Bone sunglasses and these will also come with the case as well and these are some silver rag and bone aviators and they have like the lenses are like um kind of mirrored like they have like it's like a half mirror but they also are an ombre and they kind of have like a blue pink lens it's almost like a tannish bluish they're really cool. And they have silver frames. And these are in like new condition. And the little ends are in like a nude pink color. Yeah, these are cute. And these are item number five. Rag and a bone silver aviators with light brown slight mirrored lenses with a uh, box like a new condition. But with the case, not box. Okay, and these are gonna be Okay, these are gonna be just $65. That's gonna be item number five. For 65, that's our rag and bone. And again, they will come with the case as well, and these are in like new condition. Then next, I have. I'm not letting go of any more sunglasses. I love my aviators slash um, mirrored sunglasses so much. These are Mont Blanc aviators. These are also in like new condition. These have silver um, frames and then the, like I said, the the lenses are mirrored. These are number six. These are our Mont Blanc silver metal aviators with mirrored Lenses like new, and these were okay. We're gonna do these for just $95. That's gonna be item number six. And then I 
have these green Burberry sunglasses with green lenses. Right here. My crooked eyebrows are definitely showing. <laughs> but they're green lenses, green frames, and then they just say Burberry on the sides in silver. They're really cute, except they're like definitely too small for me. That's number seven. Green Burberry sunglasses with green lenses and silver hardware. And these are how much we have for these guys? Okay, these are $85. For the Burberries, oh, it looks like Purple Rain is calling item number four, and those are our Pradas. Congratulations, Purple Rain. Those are going to you, our Prada sunglasses. And Pollyanna's calling number seven. Congratulations, Pollyanna. Those were our Burberries. And then looks like um, someone was calling number six. And that was Sarah. Congratulations, Sarah. Number six is going to you. And those are the Mont Blancs, I believe, right? Yeah. Mont Blancs. Where did those go? I think those are these. Yes. Congratulations, you guys. Oh, another ad? Didn't they, like, not show up last time? I think they didn't show up last time, right? I don't think I heard anyone say anything about the um, ads from the last live. That's so weird. They just like come up like sporadically now. Okay, next up I have... Okay, I have um, these Dior sunglasses, and these are like the all, like the whole thing, like the whole front piece is like one piece of glass, and it's in like a brown lens, and then it just has gold arms, and it has like little nose pieces right there, and these look like this. These are um, our Dior sunglasses and these are number eight your brown all glass front sunglasses with gold metal No, I don't think I did. I think this is the first time I put these up. Maybe. Okay. These are going to be a little bit more expensive because I had to pay more for these. So these are going to be 155 And these are going to be item number 8. These are so good. The size of these are just so nice too. And these are also like in like new condition. And this is item number eight. And then next up. Oh, these also will come with a case as well. Do the Dior case. That's different. I think that might be it for my sunglasses right now. Is that it? Oh, I do also still have like that pair of um, 
Chanel sunglasses that's missing the little nose piece. So I still have these Chanel sunglasses, the aviators. They have a gold uh, metal frame. Oh, Purple Rain's called number eight. Oh, Temples. Thank you, Edie. <laughs> I always just call them arms. Congratulations, Purple Rain. I'm glad you got these. These are so pretty. So they're so good. Um, these are the damaged. Well, not damaged, but they're missing the little nose piece. And those are replaceable. But these are Chanel Aviators. I'm going to have to remember Temples. Temples. Temples, Temples, Temples. Okay, it's Chanel Aviators. Gold metal frames with brown. <gasps> oh, and stop looking up there. <laughs> Hold on. I need to hide that. Uh-huh. With brown lenses. Um, and... Missing nose piece. And these are just $85. That's going to be item number nine. Yeah, it's just missing, missing the little nose piece right there. Otherwise, the sunglasses are in pretty good shape. That's those. And trying to look at my secret goodies up there. <laughs> um, Fanny Buster Charms. <laughs> Oh, wait, I have these. How did I forget about these? Um, hold on. I think I need to try to clean these off really quick and see. Oh my gosh, you guys are so hilarious. Oh my gosh, my phone is, my, camp, my computer is about to die. I forgot to plug it in. And Vadrian hung up on me. Okay, hold on a second. How do I... Where is my plug? Ah! Don't die, computer. We need you. Okay. Okay. I think we're okay. We plugged it back in. Um. Hold on. Let me just clean these sunglasses off really quick. I think they're just like a little fingerprinty. Oh yeah, these are just fingerprinty. This next uh, pair of sunglasses, these are Tom Ford's. And these are a black frame and then they have gold temples and like the middle piece is also in gold. It's kind of like a hybrid aviator. Just like the part around the lenses is plastic, and then the rest is in the metal. Okay, this is what these look like. So, black, and then the gold. These are in pretty good shape. They have like an ombre gray lens. The only thing is there's just a little scratch on this left lens. It's very, like, light. It's, like, not noticeable, but there is just, like... A little scratch that goes right there but this is how they look like they're really cute Warm down on this guy. <laughs> oh my gosh stop <laughs> the charms Vader they're looking at my Fendi backpack charms okay um what number is this one nine Okay, these are our black... Oh, what was number 10? What was number 9? Oh, that was the Chanel's. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay. So these are number 10. These are our black Tom Fords. Black Tom Ford sunglasses with... Old hardware. And... 
And how much are these, baby? Okay, we're doing these for 110. These are um, Tom Ford's um, Hypatia. And they're in really good shape, other than like, it has a light scratch. Right. It doesn't even show on camera. It's really small. It doesn't like show when you're wearing them, but. <laughs> um. No, let's do one. I have two. Should I do the red one or the black one? Yeah. Okay. Oh, look at that little bit of color. Okay, you guys wore me down. We'll do one of these. Um. <laughs> Kirsten. Hi, Jean. Okay, we're going to do this little charm this is our black fendi mini backpack charm uh so cute i actually attached like um so it has like a regular little connector thing right here to attach to like your keys or your bag or whatever but i also attached these little d rings on here and you can just remove them uh, you can, like, the back straps are fully, like, movable, so you could just undo this and take them out. But, if you have a silver strap or something like this, like, if you had, like, a little, um, strap on it, like, that you can use, like, a little bag strap. This one doesn't, like, completely match, but I'm just showing you guys this as an example. You can attach it to the bag. And then now, you have an eensy teensy, like, little cross body bag, which is so, so cute. And, oopsies. Hold on. Come on. You're embarrassing me, monster backpack. I didn't have the right direction. There you go. So now you just have, like, a little backpack which is so cute that you can wear as a crossbody. And then you can't, like, this fits, like, cards and stuff. You can fit your AirPods inside of here. And it's super duper cute. And he is in nylon and leather combo. So, like, the, like, the majority of the backpack is in nylon. And then this is like a little leather piece right here. And the eyes are, um, the eyes and like the little stripes up top are also leather. And then we just have like the little fur at the top. And he's in a wonderful condition. Super duper cute. And this one is going to be item number 11. How much is it going to be here? Black, nylon, and leather Fendi backpack. How much? Is it the same one? So how much am I going to do? Okay, we're going to do this one for 200 That's going to be item number 11 for a little Fendi. Uh, no, I don't feel too... It's okay for selling this one. Don't feel bad, Pollyanna. <laughs> All right, congratulations, Pollyanna. You really wanted it. Where did it, where'd my gavel go? <laughs> congratulations. Yeah, you're going to have to show me your little backpack on your charms, okay? And I'm going to just leave the D-rings on there. You can just take them off. You just undo the little backpack straps, like the little buckles. So, let's go on to you. Congratulations.
guys are wearing me down. But it's okay. That's not all of my Fendi mini backpack charms. You're not seeing all of them. <laughs> no, it's okay, Pollyanna. I secretly have a couple more hidden that you guys can't see. <laughs> oh, gosh. It's so bad. I'm hot. I have a, I have a problem. All right, next item. Um, did I finish all my sunglasses? Ah! Oh, do you guys want to see the? These are the sunglasses that um, Hipatia was asking about in the beginning. They're so fabulous. And then I also found out that these are literally still like in stores, like full price. I thought they were like an older style, but they're so cool. Yeah, I think they retail for almost like six hundred dollars for these sunglasses. They're so cool. My mouth just <laughs> There's not that many more, I promise. There's actually another one up there that you might not be able to see. And then I have another one somewhere else. So I think I only have three other ones. Oh no, these are these. Do you like all these? Do you have a Dior? Um, I have the red one. I also have the like a mini backpack in the pink also. And then I have a black one. Yeah, Edna Mode, Kristen, exactly. I'm gonna I think I might keep these for now. Yeah, okay, I'm gonna keep these for now. I just got these. I think I wanna wear them a little bit more before I decide to let them go. So those are gonna stay with me. Yeah, it was in the hall. That's why people are asking. I can't do these because I love these. These are the ones that I have two pairs of. I think this is the last pair that I have. Uh, yeah, Hannah, I can show you. Oh, no, I like these two. Okay. I think that's it for the sunglasses for today, at least. Um, unless I find some more hidden that... Yeah, it is. Oh, it's not. It's actually like, um, it's a traffic cone. So this is a Anya Henmark traffic cone leather charm. But this is, um, this is the black one. This is the larger one. It's actually such a cute size. Um, this one's pretty rare. And it has like these silver... Like, I don't know if you would call them studs, but like silver metal. They look like stitching, but it's like silver hardware. And there's like a little front pocket right here. And it's like so cute. I actually keep my little um, Osmo in here, which I need to start using again. But it's so, so cute. And it's huge. Hmm? I know she has a little dust on top of her. Don't look. They didn't stop calling me out on how dusty she is. But that's her. She's really cute. If you want to see, like, a size comparison, like, that's, like, the size difference between the two. She is actually really large. She can hold a lot. You can probably just use this as a bag by itself. And that's why I also put D rings on her. So that way, like, this one could actually be used, like, as an actual everyday bag. Because a small enough phone could actually fit inside of her also. So then you can have a cute little crossbody. Yay. 
<laughs> you know, I was actually thinking about letting this one go. It's so cool. This is an Anya Hinmark um, traffic cone charm. It's fully leather. And look at the tassels. Are, like, it has like a million tassels around like the bigger tassel. And it's just a charm, which is really, really cute. Uh, Pollyanna, yes, this one is also Fendi. I actually had this one for a while. I've had this one for years. I think I did, like, a video on it, like, a while back. But I've had this since, I think, like, 20... I know for sure I had it in 2019, because I actually took this with me to the Philippines. So, I've had it at least in 2019. I think I might have gotten it at the end of 2018, though, is when I got this guy. Um, but, we are doing the Hanya Henmark charm. I've been thinking about it, and I think I'm letting her go. I've had her for a while also. I think I've also had her since at least 2019. Probably since 20... I think I actually had her since 2017. I've had her for a really long time. So, this is our Anya... Mark Traffic Cone Charm. And this is how much we have Okay, we're doing this one for 150 She makes the cutest charms, too. She always does really fun stuff with, like, she's very whimsical with her designs. Okay, so that's number 12. Oh, Pollyanna's calling it! Congratulations! Goodness gracious. You yep. Going crazy with the charms. I love it. You know how much I love a good charm. I have very many of them. <laughs> okay, number 13. Um, I, did I have an... Oh, you know, I have another one. Hold on, wait. I think it's over here. Okay, now this one, it's so cute. <clears throat> and this one's actually a even bigger charm. And this one's supposed to be, um, a bowling pin, like when you go bowling. Um, but it's actually missing one tassel right here, which is such a bummer. But I mean, you honestly can't really tell. Um, it is huge in comparison to the other one. This is like the mama charm, right? And it's so cute. Um, this one retailed for like, I think this retailed for $650 was the retail on this. Yeah, I was obsessed with these charms for a hot second. I'm still on the hunt for like the extra large, just like a double tier yellow tassel charm from Anya Hinmark that I'm obsessed with and I have never found it. So I'm still on the hunt for it, but... I have this one. Oh, Pollyanna. I'm such a good influence. <laughs> oh, it could also be badminton, actually. It doesn't say what it is. It could be badminton also. But is it... Does it have the red on the top? Oh, it does, huh? You're right. I thought it was a bowling pin thing. I honestly think it even said bowling pin in the description of the when I bought it. But I think you're right. It is a, it's a shuttlecock, right? Why did I think of that? I actually I would actually like sub in for badminton when they were like missing a player during the games because I was on the tennis team in high school and I had friends that were um that would be on the that were on the badminton team and then I would sub in if they were missing people during games. <laughs> Even though I wasn't the best at badminton, but I was or at bad at um not badminton. Yeah, badminton. Yeah, I wasn't the best, but I was still going anyway. 
Okay, so I think you're right. I think it is a shuttlecock. That's crazy. This is number 13, then. It's missing a tassel. So this is our Anya Hinmark um, XL Leather Badminton. Oh my gosh, I cannot spell. Shuttlecock charm with gold hardware. And it's missing a tassel. And this one I got for $230. I'm just going to sell it to you guys for the same price because it is missing the little tassel. But it's an otherwise perfect condition. Um, and that's going to be item number 13. It is really hard. Like, you'd think it wouldn't be as hard as tennis, but I feel like it's harder. Because, like, the shuttlecock, like, it goes really fast and they can just, like, slow down really quickly, too, because of, like, the little thing on the end of it. And, I don't know, it's just like, whoo! It can get pretty crazy. But yeah, I would play doubles. <laughs> and I was, like, honestly, like, not the best, but it was still pretty fun. I think I actually pretty, I actually enjoyed it. It was, it was cool. I didn't play in too many games, though, luckily. So, I didn't contribute too much to them um, not winning anything. Though, in the games that I did play, I think we actually did win. Except, like, one game. I think we lost. Yeah, yeah, I lost one game. But it was always really close, because I wasn't, like, the best at badminton. badminton especially because I never really practiced ever. I only ever played when they would ask me to sub in. And sometimes I would play, like, for fun with some of my friends that were on the team. But that wasn't very much at all. Okay, next up, number 14. I think, um... That's it for the charms today. I'm already getting. Yeah, I think that's it for the charms today. Um, I'll see if I can get some more charms out of my life in the next live sale. I'll have to go through them. I'll have to talk myself through it. Okay, next item, number 14, is going to be... This is so funny, though. Can you imagine? Like, these two charms together, like, on a bag, would be so cute. They're really heavy, though. I don't even know the difference. <laughs> uh, Badminton has the higher net, and then they have the shuttlecock, which kind of goes a lot slower, and also the shuttlecock doesn't touch the floor. <laughs> okay, Patia. Oh, I'm always looking for a new Loewe. So, I'm crazy like that. Do I not have any more sunglasses? I think these are it. What do I have in here? Oh, I think these are just an empty case. Oh, I have these. Hold on. I think we might have a little bit more. These are St. Laurent. These are the cat eye... Um, Metal sunglasses with the gray lenses. And these have like some like scratches on the on the frames. Oh, you can see them right there. So there's some there's one right there. And then on this side, there's like the little ones on the bottom. But they're such cute sunglasses. Like. These are so fun. These are going to be item number 14. And these are St. Laurent. St. Laurent metal cat eye sunglasses. Hi, DG House. With gray lenses. And they do have some some marks on the frame, on the, on the lenses. How much are these, Vadrian? Okay, we're going to do these for $90. And that's going to be item number 14. Are those going to be the last of the sunglasses? Do I have anything else that I forgot about? Oh, then I still have the McQueen sunglasses too, if anyone's interested. And I think these are the last pair that I have.
these are the Alexander McQueen sunglasses, and these are in, um, these are brown, the frames, and then it's tortoise shell, and then it has gunmetal, um, hardware on the sides. They're like a metal with like the little skulls on the front. They are pretty fierce, right, Kirsten? Okay, so these are Alexander McQueen sunglasses, brown frames with gunmetal hardware, and these are going to be, okay, these are $85, and that's number 15. I'm going to have to figure out, like, the deal with the ads. I'm so sorry. That's so weird. I thought, like, they, they fixed themselves, because I think the last like, two sales didn't have any ads in them during the lives, right? And then, like, <laughs> now they're, like, back. Oh, goodness. Uh, next up, I had an eye for sunglasses. <laughs> As I'm showing sunglasses. Okay, now we're back to the bags. I still have our little hedgehog. I feel like we need to name this little guy at this point. We've had him for a while. Oh, actually, look how cute this hedgehog is on a black sweater. It's super cute. Okay, so this is our Gucci. Oh, yeah, if you guys can give the video or the live a thumbs up, that always does help the channel immensely. Thank you so much, Fighting Solace. Uh, also, if you guys would like to enter the giveaway, let me leave that link one more time for you guys. Don't forget to enter. I'm giving away that navy blue twilly today. There you go. That is um, the link for the video. It was yesterday's video. I didn't have a new video this morning, unfortunately. I've been trying to finish up all my tax stuff by the, by, before the weekend. Um, so I have been, like, doing that nonstop. Here is today's giveaway, though. This super cute Twilly. And it tried to show me an ad, but it glitched. <laughs> and, oh, gosh. Okay, so that's our give, oh, that's our giveaway link, okay? Leave your answer in the comments. And then for number 16 is our Gucci Hedgehog. So cute. Um, it's so fun. It has like the Gucci monogram. And then we have the magenta. And then orange. Like leather trim for like the ears. And like the little spikes. And it's orange around. And then the back is also in the monogram as well. This is in like new condition. It has silver hardware. It's actually such a fun bag. Like, also, Vadrian is babysitting right now, and the baby is screaming. It's so cute, but he does not. Um, he does not want to. <laughs> Wait, why is he running around? Why is he screaming? He's trying to go outside. Oh, he wants to do it outside. Oh, and... Oh, really, Hana? What kind of hedgehog? Like, what was its name? <clears throat> what what requirement did they change, Hana? I'm trying to get all of my stuff in order because um, I'm meeting with my accountant next week. And I'm really scared to see how much I'm going to have to pay. <laughs> Um, what else? Yeah, so it's pretty much like new. The interior, it doesn't have any, like, pockets or anything. It's just orange lining. And then we have, um, this is the Certificate of Authenticity on the inside. So this is our Gucci Hedgehog Hedgehog bag. Like... And this is how much, Fadrin? Okay, this one is 800. Oh, 
phone check. Let's see. I don't think it's going to fit with the case on, but let's see if I take off the case. A little bit. How long did you have your hedgehog for, Hannah? Okay, it doesn't fit all the way. It like sticks up ever so slightly, just like that. So the largest iPhone does not fit even without the case. But if you have a smaller iPhone, if you have like the regular size iPhone or the mini, um, this is the case from the regular size iPhone, that will fit inside no problem. And then you'll be able to zip it up still. So. Just the largest iPhone does not fit. Uh-oh, my phone went crazy when I put it back inside. Hello, Adrian, can you hear me? Oh, I think my phone hung up. Okay. There is, but... Not that. Oh, to find a vet. Oh, Hannah, I'm sorry to hear that. <laughs> what was your um hedgehog's name, Hannah? Maybe we should name this hedgehog the same name. It's so cute. Okay, seventeen is up next, and I have. The baby really wants to go outside, huh? She loves hamburger and mealworms. I also love hamburgers, but I don't think I like mealworms. Um, we still have this coach, Tabby. And she's gorgeous. This is in a cream and then the snake print, and then tan. And then this is a smooth leather on the back. It's also in that same color as the top flap, but the top flap is in a pebbled leather. There's a little hole right here from where they put like the little sensor. And there are some like indentations in the leather in the back. I got them um, to come out a little bit. They used to be a lot deeper. But, unfortunately, I wasn't able to get them out completely. Um, there also are a couple small indentations right here on the right as well. But the front looks fantastic. Magnetic snap here at the top. There's a pocket right here. And then there's a middle dividing zipper compartment. And then in the back, we just have one pocket right there. It has this mustard-colored... Um, microfiber interior lining and this also does come with the original care instruction booklet we have the little charm right here the hang tag top handle and then the cross body and this has light gold hardware and this is our coach tabby this is number 17 in cream, tan, and snake print leather with brass hardware. And this one is 115. And no, I didn't. Let me check it out, Hannah. Hold on. Let me find. Also, I'll include the link to Discord if anyone, oh, excuse me, would, um, like, oh, got like a hiccup. If anyone would like to join. Let's see. Let me leave our little link. So here is our Discord link right there. I can't believe our little Discord family has grown so much. Like, there's so many of us inside. Wait, I can put new themes to vibe the Discord? 
Oh, I have to get Nitro to make Discord yours with unique colors. <gasps> it's tempting me. I, I, I love colors. How do I unlock Nitro? Do I have to pay for that? <laughs> okay, not me trying to check it out. Um... Oh my gosh, Phoenix Mom, are you in here? Those are the same style. Hold on. Sorry, I have, like, been absent from Discord because, I mean, trying to do the taxes and everything. Oh, that's so cute. Is that the one you were talking about? The graffiti top handle? <gasps> so nice. Wait, how much is that going for? Let's see. <gasps> 750 tray expensive, but that's really nice. I love it. Okay, sorry, I'm like totally distracted. <laughs> the colors aren't that great. I have nitro in it. Oh, okay. Are there any any other benefits for getting for having nitro like for the group? Um like, for, like, our Discord group that, like, we can have. If there are, like, cool benefits, I would be down to do nine ninety nine a month for the thing. I could probably write that off in my taxes for next year. <laughs> Not me always thinking about tax write-offs now. Oh, Pollyanna, she has all the paints. I've already bought her all of them. And I already have all... I have a lot of them, too. I have... I think I actually have more paints than she probably does. I have so many. <gasps> oh, that's true. No size limits for the photos. That is pretty annoying. You can use animated emotes and post larger files, custom banner. Oh, okay. Can I actually, well, but if I get Nitro, like, will it, like, be for, like, the whole, like, um, Discord channel? Because that would be pretty cool. If it's, like, for the whole, if, like, the whole channel, like, if everyone in the channel can use that stuff, then, um, I think that'd be pretty cool. Okay, yeah, I think I'll probably I'll probably try and do it then. If you guys think it's worth it, I'll get it for our Discord group. Oh, your custom banner is cute. It has no face. I love it. Ooh, yeah, I, I I always forget to tell you guys about that, because I saw, um, when I went to the coach store at South Coast Plaza, you can, like, customize your own, like, coach robes and stuff, which I think is really cool, and just being able to customize with, like, the little charms on any, like, pretty much any of your coach bags, I think is really fun. I still have to bring another bag in to get it done, and I think I'm gonna bring in the, like, the black coach that I have, um... I forgot the name of it, but I think I want to bring that in to get, like, some custom charms. I think it's the Coach Beat Bag. And I think this would be so cute, too, to do some charms on. <gasps> Imagine, like, the jeweled C, like, the C, the jeweled one that I showed you guys before would be so cute on this. And if I put some, like, tea roses on here, it'd be fun, too. Like, ah, uh, so many cool things. There's so many choices. Oh, it wouldn't be for the whole channel. Oh, I could do ch I could do banners for the channel too. Wait, so then I'm gonna have to look into this. If it's like if I can do it for the whole like if anyone in the like as long as they're in the channel, if they could do that stuff within the channel, I think that would be pretty cool. I may or may not have seen something like that before it. Because I think you can do something to let the whole channel have it. Like, as long as it's within the channel, I think. Oh, individually you still have to get Nitro. That's kind of lame. Never mind. I thought, like, it would be for everyone to be able to use it, like, in the Discord channel group. Ah, oh, yeah. I'm going to look into it. We'll see. It would be kind of cool to have a banner, though.
Okay. Um, next up, we have item number... Oh, this was... Oh, are we on 17? Gucci Hedgehog. And then 17. You can make emojis. Oh, wait, what was number seven? How much was that one again? Okay, so we're on 18. <laughs> Thank you, Pollyanna. Unhinged emotes. What's up? Um, wait, so I can design my own emote? Emo are they called emotes? Emotes? Hi, Terry! Yeah, Terry, th t during this live, I guess, like, the ads are popping up. It's weird. Okay, let's do... <laughs> I love when he screams. It's so funny. Uh, this is a little Kate Spade lunchbox style satchel. This is in a gray and black Safiano leather. And then we have light gold hardware. This is a newer style too. There's a nice front pocket right here. And then... We have the crossbody strap, which is adjustable and removable. There's the bottom. There's the back. The exterior in really great shape. The inside's also in really great shape as well. This also does have little gussets on the side too, so that way um, the your like the contents of the bag aren't just gonna fall out when you open it up. And then there's one interior pocket in there, back here, and it's a pink in the interior. Make an emoji that says unhinged. <laughs> I know, Adrian. You have YouTube bread. Oh, yeah, Finding Souls. I think if you pay for YouTube, you don't get any ads at all. That's what Adrian says. Okay, so this is our... Gray and black Safiano leather Kate Spade lunch box style bag with light gold hardware. And this is how much for this one? Okay, we're doing this one for $75. That's number 18. And then number 19 is next and i have a this is a little um made well bag and this is in like a peacock blue color it's really cute it has a little drawstrings on the sides it's kind of like a mini transport satchel this is like the drawstring one um it's in pretty good shape on the exterior like, very minimal, if any, signs of wear. There might be, like, some slight, slight rubbing on the corners, but nothing crazy. And then interior just has one interior pocket, and this bag is unlined, so there's no um, lining inside of here. It's just suede in the interior and that pocket is a zipper pocket in the inside. And the crossbody strap is adjustable and it is removable. And it's a really cute color. I love the size. And this is our peacock blue made well small drawstring. Oh, Kirsten, no, there's no zipper across the top. It's just open. There's just the one zipper and the, the pocket has a zipper. But there's no, and there's no like magnetic snap or anything. You pretty much just have like the drawstring if you wanted to like keep it kind of closed. Like you drawstring it like that. And then So 
So it'd be like that. And how much is this patron? And this one is going to be $55. <laughs> Kirsten. It is such a pretty color, though. It's really nice. Okay, next up, we got number 20. The baby. The baby misses going outside because it's been raining so much. He probably just wants to go run around in the grass or something. He's so cute. Just a little angel. Okay. Our next item is... Oh, I still have the little Polly Pocket bag. This is the Marc Jacobs one. It's the Heaven collab. Or not Heaven collab. It's the Heaven collection. It has a little two-headed bear embossed on the front. And it's in a baby blue, has a little crystal topper right here. Uh, Pollyanna, yes. Hi, Tanya. And here is the interior. So fun. There's one interior pocket inside. Okay, so this is our blue Mark Jacobs Heaven um, Poly Pocket bag with silver hardware. How much is this one? How much? Okay, this one has three fifty, but let's do three twenty. Um, Tanya, I had some coach, but I don't think anything that you haven't seen. I don't. I don't have any. I didn't have any new coach today. Um, Pollyanna, did you send me a message on Discord? Because I don't think I see anything from you. Oh, wait, there it is. Sorry, I think it wasn't a me was it your... There we go. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, um, next up, we got 21. Uh, let's do... I love, though, that Mark Jacobs is, like, bringing back all of his old goodies. Like, the stab bag is so cute. Oh, good Good luck, Tanya. Happy thrifting. I hope you find some treasures. I have um, this Kate Spade satchel. This one is pretty cool. This is a uh, laser cut Safiano. And it's in this, like... What color would you call this? It's like a mint color. It has gold hardware, top handles, cross body strap is adjustable and removable. There's the bottom. I love the laser cut leather details. I think that's really cool. Or like a seafoam green maybe, right? Here's the interior. There's a zipper pocket and then two open pockets on the inside. There is some slight discoloration up by where the zipper is. Um, it does come with a little care booklet inside as well. But otherwise, the bag is in great shape. The exterior is in really good condition. 
and so is the interior. Just the discoloration up at the top. <coughs> oh, excuse me. Oh my gosh. <laughs> the allergies. Uh, hey, Bevan, how are you? This is our um, sea foam green laser cut Safiano uh, Kate Spade satchel with light gold hardware. And this is going to be. Okay, we're going to do this one at $65. That's going to be number 21. Did I put $656? I meant $65. That's crazy. Hold on, let me fix it. Oh, thank you. These allergies are going crazy. Uh, and I'm going to go outside, too, because I'm going to go pick up Kate. It's because it stopped raining for a second. Now the plants are just, like, releasing all of their pollen into the air to attack me. And next up, we have... <laughs> the baby's just screaming in my ear. Um, there's this Tory Burch clutch. This one is in a black soft piano leather. It has gold hardware. There are some like light marks on the hardware, but nothing crazy. The rest of the bag though is in wonderful condition. It has one interior like little zipper pocket in the back. And then it has three built-in card slots on the other side. It doesn't show. And then it has like a slip pocket as well. Um, we'll turn lock right there. That's going to be number 22. This is our black Safiano leather Tory Burch clutch with gold hardware. And this one's going to be how much, Adrian? Okay, this is $110, but we're going to do $100 today. That's going to be number 22. Our Tory Burch clutch. Next up, we got 23. And I think we're going to end at 25. Um, I need to finish some work. And I have to go pick up Cade still, too. And I think I might go to the thrift store before picking him up really quickly. So, <laughs> and then I'll see you guys again tomorrow night. I already have that live sale set up. I think I set it up by either 7 or 8 p.m. Um, so, I'll see you guys then also. Or should I do it in the morning tomorrow? I don't know. Do you guys want a morning live tomorrow or do you want an afternoon live? Let me know what you guys think. Um, tomorrow's Friday, right? Yeah, tomorrow's Friday. Oh my gosh, the week has just gone by so quickly. Oh, Sarah, sinus infection. I'm sorry, that's awful. I hate sinus infections. Those are the worst. Okay, I still have this little coach cherry bag. It's so cute. I forget the name of the style, but it's adorable. I also have a yellow one still, too. So I have both. And they're the same, like, silhouette. This one is the puffer one, and this one is like embossed but printed with the little cherries. This one is in like new condition. It also has a little hang tag, and it has uh, three little card slots built in to the interior. But it's so cute. This is such a good summer, spring bag. It's so fun. Okay, so this is our Coach Cherry shoulder bag. Okay, so you guys want me to come on during the day? I don't think I've done, like, a Friday daytime live in a while. So maybe I will. Okay, I'll change the time. I'll do it during the daytime. The Swinger! Thank you, Tara! 
You're the best. And how much was this reader in for this guy? Okay, this one's 250. And that's number 23. Oh, my nose. I have to like wash my face. I feel like whenever my allergies start acting up, if I just like wash my face, it just feels so much better. Actually, it feels way better if I take like a whole shower <laughs> and just like try to wash off all the allergens on my body. Then that's like the best. Uh, next up, I have a number 24. And this is a Philip Lim little messenger satchel bag in this beautiful green color. And it has brass hardware. We have the top handle. It does have a crossbody strap as well. But here's the exterior. It does have some minor um, rubbing on the corners. Some like slight discoloration from rubbing. But nothing too crazy. It has. It's a beautiful shade of green. I love the brass hardware. And then you open it up. We have the crossbody strap in the interior, which is adjustable, but it's not removable. And then there's just one interior zipper pocket just right there. And the interior is lined in just like black lining. And this is our green Philip Lim. How much are we doing this one for a patron? Yeah, we're going to do a discount on this one. Uh, this is going to be $85. This is our green Philip. Messenger. Okay. So, 85 It's going to be item number 24. And then our last item for the day... It's gonna be 25. I agree, Kirsten. I do love a green purse. I feel like green purses are few and far between. I feel like there's not very many, like, especially like this color green. I feel like this color green is so good. Um, okay. What's our last item gonna be? I want it to be cool. Yeah, peacock blue. Uh, do I have anything super cool? Hmm. Should I do a really good discount on one of these bags? Okay, our last we're gonna we're gonna use this la this pink Chanel bag as our last item. This is a pink Chanel flap, and this is in a pearlescent pink color with the ruthenium hardware turn lock. Uh, we have the crossbody strap is um, right here. It's convertible, so you can also wear it as a shoulder bag as well. Yeah, it's a bag. It has some like very slight like rubbing on the corners, and then on the back, it does have these little marks right here, like these little indentations where some of the color also has come off. So, but they're just like right there in that back right corner. And then when you open it up, it's like this. And then the interior just has that one zipper pocket on the inside. It's such a beautiful bag. The pearlescent pink is so good. <gasps> no way, Kirsten! I, I'm excited to see it. Telling about trying to take it today. Oh, that's cool. To, that's cool, Kathleen. $82? That's a good deal. Okay, so this is our pearlescent pink Chanel quilted flat bag with ruthenium hardware. And how much was this featuring? Okay, we have this one, I think, at, like, 1900 Let's do... 
Okay, we're going to do 1,750 today. So this is our last item for the day. Our deal price for the Chanel. And that's going to be number 25. I love emerald green too. That's why I've been working on that one um, metallic Kate Spade that I was making into like a metallic emerald green color. I still haven't finished it. I'm like literally looking at it right now. It's sitting on my shelf. But um, when I finish it, it's going to look fantastic. And I'm really excited to show it to you guys. Uh, but that is it for today. Uh, let me know if you guys have any questions about anything though. Let me leave the link also one more time for the giveaway for anyone that hasn't had a chance to enter. And... Oh, Carmen, we're opening our gifts. Um, We just picked the people that we were going to get on Monday. And the day for the gift exchange, when did I set it for? Oh, I think it's going to be next week, right? Hold on. Let me see what I put on the actual Elfster thing. Let me see. Elfster. Dun, dun, dun. And I think it's like sometime next week is when we're going to be um, picking... Or, or opening our gifts. Let's see. <clears throat> yeah. Um, we're doing, we're, the, we're having the gifts delivered by hopefully April 1st. To get your gifts delivered by April 1st. And that's, I think that's the day that we're going to be doing the unboxing. Or the opening. It's going to be April 1st. Yeah, April 1st. Ooh, I love the Chloe parody. That's one of my mom's favorite bags. She has a navy blue one. It was the bag that she got for when um, Cade was born. <laughs> to commemorate his birth. Yeah, it's next Saturday, though. So, you still have, like, a week and a half to mail it out. But, I mean, if, if everyone needs, like, a little bit more time, it's fine. I can always push it back. Was it yesterday? I thought it was Monday that, the, that people got the name. Sorry. I thought it was on Monday that everyone got the names for the um, gift exchange. I can push it back. We can push it back. I don't want you guys to be stressed out. Let's just do like April. We could do like, um, do you want to do April 6th or 7th? We're going to do 6th or 7th if you guys want. It's okay. I haven't gotten my person's gift yet either, so. We can definitely just push it back. <laughs> yeah, we can push it back if you guys need more time. That's no problem. I should have probably left, like, more time for, um, yeah. We can push it back. Just let me know what you guys want to do. Goodbye, Purple Rain. Thank you for joining us today. Yeah, let's do it, but let's do, um, let's do it on the 7th then, on our Friday. That'll be good. Oh, it is Good Friday. <laughs> so it'll be very good. We'll do Good Friday then. So April seventh, we'll we'll do the um, the gift exchange. Oh. 
Oh, I'm sorry, Purple Rain. Okay, yeah, so let's do, we'll do um, Good Friday then next, so that'll be on the 7th. <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, so let me leave the link one more time in case anyone hasn't had a chance to enter. Oh my gosh, my allergies are attacking me. Why? Okay, we're going to pick our winner in three, two, one. Do, 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 do. All right, our winner today is DG House. DG House loves totes in the summer. Same, I do love a good tote. Totes for the totes. Congratulations, DG House. You are the winner of our super cute little um, Twilly today. So thank you so, so much. Um, invoices should be sent out within the next 15 minutes. If you're watching this video after the live is already over, check down below in the description box, items availability, and the pricing should be down there. Tune in tomorrow for another live sale. I'm going to do it earlier. So we should do maybe around 11 to 2. Um, I'll see what the schedule is going to be for tomorrow. I don't know if I have to do any pickups for the kids tomorrow. So um, I'll have it scheduled by tonight. But thank you guys again so much for hanging out with me today. Uh, so tomorrow live sale, Saturday next live. Saturday live is at 10 p.m. Pacific time. I love you guys so much, and I'll see you guys all in the next one. All right, bye, guys. I got to go sneeze. <laughs> bye.